On April 12, Freddie Gray was arrested by the Baltimore police. When approached, Freddie Gray and his friends ran from the police. When the police finally apprehended Freddie, they arrested him on the charges of having an illegal switchblade. At first, Freddie Gray was arrested without force. After a struggle, he was thrown headfirst into a police van. Freddie was not buckled in when the van left. Freddie Gray requested for medical assistance multiple times in the van, but he was denied. Later, he was taken to a hospital where he died a week later. His death was caused by breaking 80% of his spine. After the death of Freddie Gray, his mother, Gloria Darden, spoke out about the six officers involved. She said it was wrong what they did and she thought they lied. Many other people agreed with her and this is what helped start the riot of Baltimore. News of Freddie Gray caused several riots in the city of Baltimore. Some of the riots turned violent. Movements like Black Lives Matter were involved. The riots were aimed at the police. People involved in the riots demanded justice and explanation for Freddie Gray's death. The riots called for the end of police brutality and a reform of the Baltimore police. The riot left parts of Baltimore with lots of property damage. After an investigation into the arrest, all six of the officers involved were acquitted. This led to more tension between police and the people. This also led to a bigger rise of the movement Black Lives Matter. Officers found support in a poll taken by People's Daily that said Americans thought the riots were criminal acts and supported police over protesters. A lot of people were upset with the results of the trial. Baltimore State's Attorney Marilyn Mosby said, we could try this case a hundred times and cases just like it, and we would end up with the same result. A lot of people were not satisfied with their response and the response of the trial. After hearing about Freddie Gray's death, President Obama said we have some soul searching to do. This is not new and it's been going on for decades. President Obama also said if our society really wanted to solve the problem, we could. It's just that it would require everybody saying this is important and this is significant.